1985, three British scientists discovered that a hole in the ozone layer had formed over Antarctica. Super alarming, I know. Later confirmed by NASA satellites, thanks NASA, the next step was figuring out where that hole came from. Enter Mario Molina of Mexico City and Sherwood Rowland of Delaware, Ohio, who figured out that chlorofluorocarbons, also known as CFCs, were behind this earth-endangering hole. They were used in aerosol cans and refrigerants, and they were really bad stuff. Eventually banned from being used, the ozone hole is now slowly healing, and will hopefully be back to normal by the mid-2040s. But why do we even care about the ozone layer in the first place? Ozone absorbs most ultraviolet radiation from the sun, but still some gets through and gives us Sunburns, but you can think of the ozone as Earth's sunblock. Well, without the ozone layer, we'd have to live underground in caves to avoid constant, terrible sunburns. That would stink. And here's a fun fact. Ozone is toxic to human lungs and a pollutant here at the surface of the Earth, but up in the atmosphere, it's Earth's savior and the only reason that life can live on the surface of the planet. So, O3, we owe you. <laughs> and the scientists who saved you. Yeah!